Hello and welcome, my name is Nilos and this is episode 12 of our Let's Play campaign of Factorio with Bob's mod and Angel's mods. Let's have a look at uh, what I've been building since last time. Let's start up by looking at, wow, I have 28 minutes left, but that's because there's only one miner left and that one is really not getting anything. So what I have done is I have finished up this one. They each now have a separate area, uh, seven. Uh, it's uh, sapphirite, stereotite, coal, bubmonium, rubite, crotinium, and jivalite. Those are the ones. What I've also been doing is basically saying you cannot go into here. So there's on no way into this except through the stacker. This stacker is quite simple. It just says main stacker. The same name for all of them. And basically I'll pass it through this one and then pass it through the next. I hope that it works. I have no idea. Um, basically that's we'll, we'll see and then I've taken it out here so that we can basically get a nice line up here on outside of this area and my intention is now with with basically being run out I will do a balancer here I've also brought another 50 of these so let's just set those up actually I think I'd want to actually I want to adjust it then we need to take every single one up typical The reason I want to do that is because if I put it exactly there, then I can actually take all of it out. And that means everyone else has to follow the same scheme. One, two, three, four, five. I'll do five of each. Actually, this one is not the same. Because this one just needs to be here. One. You know what, there, I bet there's some kind of merit to having it parallel. You know what, we'll do that just for a sense of completion. And that means this one also needs to be moved just one square up. I think eventually I want to do it because of blueprints. So I can just take one blueprint and stamp it down on everything. This one's gonna run out soon. Don't matter. I don't even want it there, do I? I think I do. Whoa! I did not see that coming. Well, I guess this has to be moved up. Two, three, four, five. So if we do five on each or six. And I want to make sure that everything gets load balanced before it moves in. There. What I want to make sure is that everyone brings to the same place. There, there, there. So now I have four inbound here, and that means at this point I need to do a load balancer. If I can recall how it is. I get something like this, and... I think it's like this. Because basically what it does is... And I'm also pretty sure that I don't need this much, but whatever. So this one goes in, in, these ones are out, this one grabs, yeah, let's see, here, okay, that should be it. The idea is that first these two are mixed, then the middle two are mixed, that means the last outer ones are not mixed, they'll be mixed in this one, and then it mixes outbound again. I don't think that one is is truly necessary however it is it's a good spot to do it so let's see how easily can we bring this out like this and then we'll have basically oops i'll use the steel chest because they are actually bigger in this case so one two three four Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Excellent. And that will be the position here. I don't think I have enough actually. And of course, I'd like to have stack inserters, but I don't have stack inserters. So, beggars can be choosers. That's. 
And that should seal it. <clears throat> I don't think this is the ideal way of, of doing it. I think it's better generally to hit it more side because the first ones will be really busy and the last ones will probably not do much. Then let's drag in this one. Yeah. Lucky that it's fit. And I'm um, doing right hand driving here, obviously. And this one will then. I also need to make sure that there's actually room for the two heads of the uh, of the train. That's probably not even going to cut it. This one. And we need to blow something up. So hold your ears. We're going to blow this up. That should be it. enough um, here. I will need to make a new train stop. Uh, what? That's not gonna fit. Why is it not fitting? Damn it, so I, I'm one off. Let's see, which way do I want it to be one off preferable? Preferably this one, yep. Let's see, that one needs to go. Okay, I th okay, I'm in trouble when it comes to the iron now, that's for sure. Because it's ever so slightly more than last time, isn't it? Not really. Let's see. Yes, and let's get these icon in there, there, and I have seven left. Use them wisely. I'm looking forward to seeing how this works when I actually get the train coming in. And I will... The funny thing about this is that there's a hell of a lot of overhead of all the turning and stackers and everything, but that's something we do in order to be ready for, um, for scale. I'm I'm always prioritizing scale when I build. All right, you need there, you're going to be there. We'll need uh, one of these, the chain signal there and there. All right, that should do it. Then we need to bring out some power poles. Ideally, it'll come in the middle here of this road or like that. And oh, that's too bad. No? Is that too far away? That's really strange, isn't it? Okay. And there. And then we'll do the rest with these. Okay, can I get more of them? Yes, luckily I can. Great. So, there, there, there. Just trying to be consistent on this. And let's hook it up. There. Everything's green. Perfect. We should see this coming in. And I want to make this one called this Sapphire Right One. Sapphire Right, yes, that sounds about right. And this is the issue. The first ones will always be loaded first, but I think that will manage. Wow. It's just not able to cope with all of this. They seem pretty well stacked out here. It's This is looking good. Great. Let's head back to... Okay. Hold on. One, two, three, four. I also want to make sure that I have some light over this area. And then I... Use the last light. And I cannot make any more. I can make one more. Brilliant. I'll make that there. All right, so I'm really down to the wire here. But I think this setup, I don't know if it works, but we'll give it a shot. Why am I running? Why am I not just jumping in the car? And at this point, I was like, ah, oh, whatever. It's, it's pretty close. I'll make it. It's going to be fine. 
I need to get in this train. I want to ride the train. Oh, one big problem is what happens when it gets back here? Okay, now it says never because it has run out. I'll remove it because I am dead. Dead on sapphire. Of course, I do have some sapphire. So basically, I need to remove it. First thing it does is go to sapphire 1 until. I'm going to get inventory full. Then it goes to main stacker. Uh, time. Nope. Cut. And I'll do that at time past zero and then goes to main sapphire until inventory empty i think that should be it how is this one doing oh yes that's gonna take a while and that's the problem with this setup that is not fast enough <clears throat> let's just see if it works now this one is waiting until or you know what I should also be saying plus time passed let's go to 100 and let's make that an or condition I don't intend to sit here and wait that long I just want to see that it's working okay it's pretty good so that's about thousand in each no 600 in each but it is it is pretty even for some reason this one is getting more what about this one no, I think they're about even. No, it's, this is getting a bit more. doesn't matter. Maybe it started a bit earlier or something. But I can also see there's no point in stacking any more up. And I'm even getting into the infinite ones, so they'll just continue forever. This is very nice having infinite order one. I wonder how much time has passed. I'd like to see it move by itself. It is an automatic. And then go to the stacker. Either because it's full. It is not going to be full anytime soon, but it's still, I mean, yeah, it's, it's 5k I now have. Come on, I'm being impatient, and so are you back home. This robot is not draining anything. Oh, okay, because it stopped. Yeah, there we go. It started by itself. Brilliant. That was the 100 seconds. Thank you for the patience. Let's see. Is it going? Uh, lights are switching colors. It goes into the first one. It stops. And it starts again. I like it. Should go into the first one, the Sapphire. Here we are. Oh, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And it'll, of course, unload a hell of a lot faster. And now the question is, what now? I'm going to bring it up to one lane. Whoa. Actually, this is interesting. It's not actually because it's, uh, it's worn out. It's because it's, it's jammed. Okay, so this one I grabbed together and now we need to bring it in and then start working on more depots. Generally speaking, for this uh, this Let's Play campaign, I will not be showing sort of now we built copper or sapphire facility number 200 and now 201. I find that kind of boring gameplay. I'll do it once in a while as it's needed. Oh, what is that? Something on the ground? Oh, hold on. I can go to the stacker, can I? Yep, I got iron. Brilliant. Then let's get some more of these belts. Actually, I also have those belts. I mean, come on. You, you've built a nice little production facility for, for that. So start using it. That's what it's for. That's a lot of steel we've sto stockpiled. And that one, that one, and that one. Only six, that's not much. I'm having issues with my wood. <clears throat> yes, with uh, the wood material for crafting. Yes, that is what I meant. Uh, however, I will do that in a future episode. Okay, you're not there anymore. That's good. Let's gather this up in so my question here is okay I'm not going to be building or putting in these uh, inserters just yet and 
And I think that's a good idea because otherwise, I'm, every time I remake it, I have to check that it's okay. I think I will let it underneath here first. That's gonna be a lot of these. Good. And then we do the splitter. Mix, 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 and just like this. I think that's it's taking up a hell of a lot of space. Wow, is that that's the one hundred that's the timing one. I'm not sure this is the correct splitter, but I don't really care. Well, I do care. I do care, but uh, in, in, in. That one goes out. That one goes out here and here. And then we should actually have pretty decent. And I'll put this one on as well. You know what? I don't even need to balance this. Why am I doing this? I don't need to bounce it because I need to bring it down to one one lane anyway so I might as well just collide them just do a hard collision here I might need to bring it into two lanes but for now I'll put it into one lane and then we'll take it from there I can't process it fast enough anyway and then I'll bring it in somewhere else nope not you that one you are done now yes this one there and I need to recuperate those red ones they are valuable great and now we can start open open the floodgates here really should have been waiting until everything was ready then the whole thing would be coming in at once great oh, right okay it's only actually sitting on one side but that's okay and this seems really strange that it's going to do like that okay and you're also done great how much do you have left this is pretty fast but now it will not be done anyway hmm. now it will never be done actually how do I make sure that this one takes the lead? This is this is kind of silly of doing this, but I really want to make sure that there that's not what I wanted. That's really not at all what I wanted. All right, screw it. You're just going to do this. That one goes out. That one goes out. And we should now... If this one can't insert anymore... Well, it can for a long time. The other ones, I don't think they're critical in any sense. Now I'm contemplating what I should be doing instead. See this one? Well, it's also infinite sapphire. I don't think my infinite sapphire will ever run out. This is now fully stacked and it can feed all of this and feed all of this, but it's also because I'm not using any iron at this point. It just goes into the stackers here and there. Uh, this one as well is full. Hmm, that's interesting. Let's build some more of these. I don't particularly like, I mean, this is also very temporary, but I don't want this one to be full. This one, I don't, oops, have a problem. Okay, this has stopped because of the stone. And I'll then get started. Do we have problems with our power? No, we do not. Okay. Now, the next item I want to build is actually a greenhouse. And I'm 
the thing is I don't want the greenhouse to be up here these are production I love the fact that I can read it from here love the fact that I can read it and this one is also very interesting uh, I want to see I really want to harvest all of this and bring it in safely into my stacky thingy uh, science this one mm -hmm. it could be this one this one could be our yeah Oh, that one. I think I'll take uh, this down here. This will be our greenhouse. That might be more appropriate to get the greenhouse here. Okay, I do one thing. Do I have barreling of crude oil? Um, yes, I do. I At least I have the barrels. And if I take one of these, can I then barrel? I can make empty barrels. But I can't put stuff in barrels. Why cannot I put stuff into barrels? What is that? That's that's batteries. Hmm. Um, let's search for something barrel. Green. Yes, this is putting crude oils in barrels. Great, so it should be possible. Which means that at this point, I really should be creating pump jack MK2. Is it faster? It is mining speed two. Mining speed. Okay, one, two, three, four. I don't have many of them, so I might as well go a bit crazy. Uh, let's also get a few of these and continue on the explodiness down here before we actually build something. Oh, sorry, forgot to uh, to warn you in advance. I lost a power pole there. Oh, it's a bad power pole, so we can live without it. I'm gonna be crying over that. Hmm. Okay, now I have a bit more space here. And you'll be... Did I get those four? No, I only got one. All right, let's try it. This one is, ah, damn, multi-phase oil. I forgot that. Oof. Yeah. I'll build four for each of them. There, there, and there. And I might as well remove this in the meantime. Because this is where the wood came from but it's kind of run out how many do I have now Ooh, I have two more great there and there and the last one and I can't even build what is this is it that's just an mk1 All right when I have the last one then I can start building come on yes And I don't have to choose. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. We get four each. I think that should keep them covered for a while. And then I need to hook them up. That's hooked up now. That one is hooked up. That one's hooked up. And that one is now hooked up. Excellent. So these, and this is something I should really have done like ages and ages ago, because the whole point is just accumulated. I'm gonna do that at some point, but I don't know when I'll come back to it. But when I do, I'm gonna be happy to have this, and then I'll barrel it and throw it somewhere, put it on a belt or something. All right. So what I wanted to do was actually look at greenhouse let's see we can at least start on the greenhouse or at least contemplate what I need okay I need glass that's not gonna be a problem I have plenty of glass um, let's look at what it does over here where do we have it oh it's Bob thing Bob thingies and I always have issues with the initial one here so I need raw wood to get it started I can't grow it with fertilizer I'll have to grow it without and I need water for that it's okay, I think. Um, 
the fertilizer comes from urea and I don't have that yet at all. So let's, um, I'll do some preparations and that's what we're gonna work on next time. It's always tricky to make it uh, balanced somehow. So that was uh, pretty damn amazing, our little uh, excursions with the train. And we definitely have enough sapphirite for the time being. And this one is just filling in as much as it can. And it's empty, brilliant. Cool, so this will be it for now. And next time we will be looking at the greenhouses so we can get the wood production up and running, which will then enable us to continue on the science. So thank you very much for joining. Now I'll hope to see you in the future episode. Thank you, bye.